ang ginawa ni Justin Bieber, malapit at kuhang-kuha ng TV5 camera. Pagkalapag pa lang sa Tacloban City, pasado alas 12 ng tanghari last Tuesday, very friendly and ready to help na si Justin. First stop at Tacloban City Central School, kung saan mainit siya sinalubong nag-aabot sa tatlong daang mga bata at mommy, si Justin, ni Yakap at tinati agad ng mga ito. Nang bisitahin niya ang isang tent sa eskwelahan, kinarga pa niya ang isang umiiyak na sanggol at pinaktahan sa kahinalikan. Priceless naman ang mga reaksyon ng mga bata sa eskwela habang pinapanood ang libre acoustic concert ni Justin para sa kanila. Ginaya pa niya sila mag-football pero dahil maambo noong araw ng kanyang pagbisita, mas pinabuti na lang ng grupo na mamigay na agad siya ng mga laruan, libro at t-shirt na baon niya para sa lahat. Ang isang inusenteng bata, walang kare-are aksyon habang binibihis ang panang isang superstar. Kinantahan pa ng pop superstar ang Yolanda Survivors na may kaarawaan. At ang isa sa kanila, muntik-muntikan pa niyang makalips na lips. Pero hindi lang si Justin Bieber ang pinanggigila ng mga kabataang survivors, kundi maging ang manager nito si Scooter Brown, na nag-abot na ng t-shirt sa kanila. Samantala, hindi pa na kontento si Justin, kaya nagpatuloy pa siya sa pagbisita sa iba pang badly hit areas ng Tacloban City, ang San Jose. Sa pagbisita niyang ito, hindi alintana ni Justin Bieber ang masaksang na amoy ng kapaligiran. Ang mapuputik na daanan at ang makipagsiksikan, mapuntahan lamang ang San Jose Elementary School. At kahit pagod na pagod at pawis na pawis, todo entertain pa rin siya, mapasaya lamang ang mga biktima ng Super Typhoon Yolanda. Bukod dito na mahagi rin siya ng mga laruan at coloring books sa mga batang survivor. Hindi rin pinalampas ni Justin Bieber maging ang paglalaro ng basketball. Ayun, panay pasok ang kanyang mga tira. Sumalin sa basketball game na ito ang Sports 5 head coach na si Chot Reyes. Matapos maglaro, pinuntahan at kinamusta na ni Justin Bieber ang mga ina at anak na pansamantalang naninirahan sa paaralan. Short and very sweet ang pagbisita ni Justin Bieber dito sa bansa, katuwang ang UNICEF, Prizeo, AIA at TV5. Para sa kanyang kampanyang Give Back Philippines, kung saan ang part ng proceeds nito ay inibigay ni Justin Bieber sa Alat ng Kapatid Foundation. Alam ko kung gaano kasikat si Justin Bieber sa buong mundo. Kaya natutuwa naman ako kapag hinihiritan ako ng believers na maswerte daw ako dahil ganoon na lamang. Kung makalapit ako sa international pop superstar. Sino mag-aakala na isang Justin Bieber ay personal na bibisita at tutulong sa mga survivor ni Bagyong Yolanda? Kaya naman ang ating mga kapatid na Pinoy, mas humanga sa ating international na kapatid. Ito po si MJ Marfori, nag-uulat para sa Marfori Exclusive. Pinakasiyahan sa ating mga kapatid sa Tacloban, dumaan naman ang international superstar na si Justin Bieber sa Manila upang makasama ang ilan sa kanyang mga tagahanga. Naroon din ang ilang celebrities at syempre, hatid namin sa inyong eksklusibong backstage pass sa event na ito. So in the beginning, I was shocked. I said, is this for real? And then it turned out that he was actually coming to help our country. And it made me even more a fan. Plano yata nila is to actually do this without press. He just really wanted to go meet the people, see what's happening or what's happening and wanted to help out. Siguro, uh, lumaki lang ang puso niya, naramdaman niya na parang mas makakatulong siya if he made it, you know, the, the, if he made the media get involved as well. Oh, my respect for him just like went up because I, at first, I thought this was all a lie. Like, I don't, I don't think that he would actually go all the way to Tacloban, but he did. I'm a really proud fan. I knew that he always had a kind heart, so I'm just really happy that he came for the Philippines this time. Rare lang ata yung dumating dito eh. So sana nga hindi lang siya pumunta dito eh. Kasi dapat parang nakikita natin na kahit sino, like the world is becoming as one as well. Pero sana naman it doesn't stop. For someone like Justin Bieber who has an immense number of following, maganda na he shows it's not just all about 
pagpa-perform or paghahakot ng fans, kundi pagbibigay rin sa mga um, nangangailangan to give back because he's getting so much. He doesn't forget to give back also. Good on ya, Bieber. More than the actual experience of playing one-on-one, -on -one, what was really very heartwarming, yung he took the effort to go out of his way, you know, from Australia instead of going back to the state, Dumancha dito, and then he raised that amount of money, playing basketball, you know, singing for them, that was all part of it. Ang family mother ko from Leyte, talaga tinamaan ng relatives namin. So, kapag nakakita ako ng mga taong tumutulong, lalo yung galing pa sa napakalayong lugar. Uh, Natatouch ako. Thank you for helping our country and putting smiles on their face. I was able to see the pictures that were uploaded and may pinus kasi sila na may akap sa mga bata. Grabe yung ngiti. Para sa mga alaalang hindi namin maliginuta. Maraming salamat sa iyo, Justin Bieber. After Justin did some graffiti at a friend's house, he did uh, something called Pray for Philippines. He asked us to auction off spray paint cans for charity. When I realized he was passionate about helping, I looked at our schedule and I realized we were on this side of the world. And I asked him, I said, if it's okay with you, I'd like to have you go there and raise money and see if we can bring help. And, and you gamely said yes. I feel like this is something that was really just strongly on my heart. I wanted to come out here and see these kids and bring some some hope to these kids, bring some, bring some inspiration. and. Let them know that, you know, it's a big world and, and God is God is great. Now, you've been to the Philippines before. Were you surprised? How did you react when you heard about what happened to Tacloban? It was unbelievable. And I said, how can we help? But we came up with a game plan, um, and here we are. Yeah. And I heard some of your fans from the Philippines will get to watch your movie exclusively. Is that true? Yes. <laughs> That's yeah? true.